Well, good morning. Yeah, good morning. And we're talking with uh, Pete Rivera. Now you're from Rare Earth. Lead, what, lead? Rivera, yeah, original lead singer, drummer with uh, Rare Earth, Motown uh, group out of the early 70s. Get ready. Okay. Now you're, you're one of the, one of the uh, original, uh, one of the first original white bands that played with Motown too, weren't you? That's correct. Okay. Yeah. All right. So that Motown was kind of a... Motown wanted to, to uh, get into the pop market. Kind of a groundbreaking thing, because of course, uh, "Get Ready," which was was a big hit, was uh, also done by what the Temptations, right? Temptations had "Get Ready" out too. Yeah, yeah written yeah. by uh, Smokey Robinson wrote the song. Okay, now you're part of the uh, a band called the Classic Rock All Stars. I guess you're you're a major um, uh, comeback. They wanted you guys back badly because you were there last year at oh, Turtle, we had a great Turtle time. Lake. Um, uh, the Classic Rock All Stars. Uh, we've been together five years, and. Uh, we call it that, for lack of a better name. We've got Mike Panera on guitar. He was a original writer-singer with a group called Blues Image. Had a big hit, Ride Captain Ride. Uh, he also was with Iron Butterfly um, in a God of Devita. Right. Mike's had a lot of hits. Produced Black Oak, Arkansas. He's, he's just he's one of the giants. Jerry Corbetta on keyboards was the original lead singer-writer. A group called Sugarloaf had Green Eyed Lady. Don't call us. We'll call you. Uh, Dennis Noda was bass player with Cannibal and the Headhunters. Uh, uh, they had Land of a Thousand Dances. Of course, I do all the rare earth stuff. We do about 200 dates a year all over the world, and uh, it's classic rock all stars. We're coming back to Turtle Creek Saturday. Now, I guess the question that we, we got to ask you guys, because I'm sure there's a couple people out there want to know. Now, uh, of course, uh, Turtle Lake is a, is a nudist camp, so it's a clothing optional. Do you guys perform in the nude? Is that why they want you back the second time, or just because you're good rock and rollers? Uh, we're good rock and rollers. No, we don't perform in the nude. And, <laughs> you know, to each their own. Yeah. Have a good time. You know, I was talking to to, uh, to Randy Bachman, and he said, uh, you know, he, I guess it was the first time he he found out that uh, he was going to be in a nudist camp uh-huh. to uh, play. And... Um, he was telling me that, you know, as far as most concerts go, you know, especially out, outdoors, the guys got the shirts off anyway. The ladies throw their stuff up on stage. So what's the difference? But, uh, well, you know, whatever rings your bell, <laughs> you know, I, I could care less, really. Yeah. Uh, it's people. It's music. It's a stage. It's the whole thing. We're going to have a great time. If you don't want to wear any clothes, well, that's fine. Okay. Okay. You now. Now, uh, in a gotta defeat it, you guys. I gotta know. Do you guys do the whole, what, fifty-two minutes of the, the no, song? No, no, we can't do that. We, I mean, we can do that, but <laughs> we're not booked for that much time. But All right. yeah, it's it's in a gotta defeat it. It's 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 long. It's it's uh, effective. It's not two minutes. I mean, it's sometimes ten, sometimes seven, sometimes twelve. I don't know. We don't. Uh, it's all according to the to the way the spirit is moving. Okay. Okay. Uh, as far as uh, how much time they, they they allow you over there for playing? I think playing? we play for about an hour and a half. Okay, so yeah. about a ninety minute show. All right. Yeah, we'll have a good time. Now, as far as far as the the rest of the band goes, I, I mean, are they making other things besides uh, working working as as the all stars? I, I heard you guys are recording an album too. Well, as, we are recording. We are recording. And okay. We're doing uh, videos. We have a double CD that that we bring with us. Uh, offer that up to the folks it's a live cd we just recorded in, in november it's great uh, we're doing uh, some television pro- projects and, and commercials i do a lot of commercials for fox television and okay uh, working on one right now i'm doing the seattle mariners theme and you know just different things you kind of stay busy but our main thing is the band and that takes precedence over everything now as far you have a double c cd out that's out now Yes, it's not in stores. It's okay. just uh, it's our own thing that we did. We recorded it live. It, it it came out just excellent. I mean, we're very proud of it. It's all of our material. It's our whole two-hour show um, with all the hits, you know, by all the original guys. Okay. And, uh, we market that ourselves. We've yeah. been on QVC with it. Uh, we're, we're we're talking about some distribution in the normal channels of of uh, stores, but it's not in stores. Right. Now, what about a normal guy like me that wants to get get a copy of this thing and can't make it to one of your concerts? How 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 will we get a copy of that? Because I'm well, I'm interested. I'm I'm a big fan of of uh, all the hits. Well, I mean, we have a one eight hundred real rock phone number. Okay. Eight hundred R E A L R O C K. Okay. One eight hundred real rock, and if people want to call that number and leave their name and and uh, address, we'll we'll send something. 
sent out to them. Okay. Send so them out, order for them, and put them on mail lists, everything. Oh, okay. So they, they know where you guys are appearing in the whole bit? Yeah. Okay. All right. That'll work. We'll have all that with us, too, yeah. Okay. So, um, you promised everybody a rocking good time as far as that goes. If they want to have a good time, I'm sure you guys can supply it for them. Um, oh, you bet. Anything else you want you wanted to say before we go? Well, no. We're just looking forward to getting back there. I'm from Michigan myself. Okay. And born and raised in Detroit, and I hope to see my brother there. He, he lives over in uh, Howell, Michigan. Okay. I think he'll come over, so it'll be a great time, and we're, we're looking forward to it. We have a good time. Okay, maybe we can uh, set you up for the uh, summer celebration here in Muskegon next year. Yeah, I hope That'd so. be nice. That'd be nice. Yeah. Well, thank you, sir. Okay. I appreciate your time. You bet, Oscar. See you there, maybe. Okay. Soft Rock 95.3, that's Celine Dion, and Only One Road. Got a very special treat for you right here, because I didn't even know you were going to call. And we're talking with uh, with Rob Grove from the Grassroots. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 how, how you, you doing? How you doing up there? Oh, not bad. Good. Well, we're sweating. <laughs> is it hot, really? Yeah, really? it is. I got Peter Tripp with me, too, because we do a show on Sunday called Reminiscing. Yeah, with Oscar and Peter. There you go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so, um... Tell us what what what's what have you guys been doing for the last uh, decade? Uh, well, aside from robbing banks, we've just been playing. <laughs> <laughs> we uh, we uh, actually since uh, 1984, we've been on the road doing about 125 shows a year. Really? Oh, wow, you 125, guys. Yeah, you guys are still doing that. Huh? Yeah, thanks to shows like Reminiscent, you know, it's just yeah, like all these radio just really started taking off and and, and it just really turned things around. In fact, I I kind of stopped touring for a while. And uh, when that happened, I just tested the market, and it was great. So we we're just working like crazy. Well, there that's, you go. That's great. It's there you super, go. man. We're looking forward to coming up there, too. Okay, so you're going to be at the Summer Celebration. It's going to yeah. be happening on a Sunday, the June 25th. Yeah. And, of course, uh, the, those who do not know, you are the lead singer. Yeah, for now, 30 years now. 30 years. Oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm 36 years old. Isn't that something? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I love yeah. it. I love it. That's so, all right. What about, what about the rest of the band? How many, how many members oh, of the original well, band? Well, we got two originals and two extra crispies. <laughs> okay, that sounds good. That sounds okay. good. Hey, I've rehearsed this stuff, you know. So it's tasty. It's all tasty. Yeah, okay. yeah that's tasty right. music. It's all, it's all finger licking good. So you're gonna be doing all. I mean, you got. Um... All, all we're doing is grassroots hits. Okay, you're gonna tell the top forty stuff or like everything. Well, no, we're not gonna do everything. I, I remember how long the show is. I have to look at, look at my sheet again. But uh, we're if you know if it's somewhere around an hour, an hour fifteen minutes, we'll just be doing grassroots hits. Okay, so we're sort no of hit... obscure material at all. No, why not? There's some fun <laughs> stuff in it. Because it's too obscure. I don't know if I remember the words. Now you're gonna you're gonna do the uh, the special stereo effects and stuff too. <laughs> <laughs> we're bringing not. a symphonic orchestra with us. Yeah, we're gonna have any flashbacks that uh, we might remember or what? Oh yeah, there'll be plenty of that. We're gonna uh, fourteen of the songs we're gonna be doing were top forty Billboard hits. Right. Okay. okay. So I, I've got okay. all fourteen of them here in front of me. I could list them yeah. off, but that would that would take too long. That would take, yeah, that would take all day. And, you what? know, we you know you guys got to get out in that sunshine and sweat a little bit more. Oh, yeah. Hey, I tell you what, the weather's great here, so you'll enjoy it. You'll be right by the lake. We always have a great time up there on the coast of Michigan up there. Okay, so yeah, we'll, it's a lot of fun. We'll, yeah. go, we'll go swimming, too, afterwards. What do you think? <laughs> Maybe even before. <laughs> oh, Maybe yeah. during. During. There you go. During during the show, you can go swimming. That's it. <laughs> okay. Super. So who else is going to be in town? Who else is going to be in town? Well, Aretha's going to be before you guys. Aretha and also before you, the fabulous T-Birds. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. No, Aretha Franklin. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The no, queen. Kidding. The queen of soul. She's playing, what, what day is she playing? She's playing on uh, Friday. On Friday? Mm -hmm. Yep. Great. Then we're going to have the uh, Fabulous Thunderbirds coming up on the 24th. You guys on the uh, 25th. Wait, wait, and got, uh, the Guess Who coming? And the Four Tops will be following you guys. Four Tops? Oh, man, that sounds great. Yeah, it's going to be a great show this year. That's terrific. Yeah. Well, so, we're looking forward to it. What are you going to do to knock our socks off? Uh, well, how about Midnight Confessions two times? Two times? <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe three times even. Ah, uh, well, yeah, uh... Well, all we want to do is we're just going to get up there and it's going to sound like a grassroots jute box, you know. We're just going to be playing the hits, and uh, 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 we just want everybody, if they know the words, to sing along loudly, get up and dance, clap their hands, stomp their feet, generally just have a party. Okay, sounds like, sounds, sounds like sounds, a good time. Yeah. Uh, a party. I, I got one question for you. Right? Okay. Midnight Confessions, your biggest hit billboard charts. What was your favorite? Temptation Eyes. Temptation yeah, Eyes. I agree. Okay, I sooner agree. or later was mine. <laughs> so, well, we're going to do all of them twice. Good, good, good. <laughs> sounds good. And I'm sure when we uh, get done with this interview, we'll we'll think of the uh, song "Things I Should Have Said." Just like, oh my <laughs> God! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, I had to play with words, you know. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Any, anything else you want to tell us? I just want to tell you we're looking forward to coming to town. Are you telling me the truth now? I'm telling You've you. You've been in Muskegon before. We're gonna be. Oh yeah, we. Have. Okay, great place. It's a great place. You won't want to leave. Great place by a great lake. There right. you go. Right. <laughs>
Play on words again. Hey, yeah, there you there go. There you go. So you guys don't use that, do you? What's that? A great place by a great lake. No, but I think we should. We should. Yeah, that's a, yeah. Yeah, adapt that. That sounds good. Jot that down. <laughs> okay, I'll jot that down. Jot that down. Um, there was one more question I want to ask you, but it, it slipped my mind, so hey, I'll, I'll ask I it figures. to you later. That figures. That's well, we'll be out of breath by the time we get there. We're playing uh, California, San Francisco on Friday, oh, yeah. Houston, Texas on Saturday. Muskegon, Michigan on Sunday. Oh, boy. <laughs> Are you coming from Houston to Muskegon? <laughs> Open up the window let me catch my breath. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay. All right. Now, as far as some of the songs, have you written a lot of your songs? or? Well, no, we had most of our songs written for us. Okay. And uh, uh, we wrote a lot of songs, but when we when it came time to pick the single, we picked the best song, and it was invariably with something somebody else wrote. Okay. So uh, Three Dog Night was in pretty much the same Same boat. way, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And we, in fact, we were both on the same label. So, okay. uh, you know, they, we, we, in fact, we even... Uh, well, Dunhill, you're right. Yeah, Dunhill. Bit. Yeah, Dunhill. Okay, yeah, because Dun yeah, Dunhill labeled What, are you us. checking on me? You're not going to believe me? No, no, I'm, I, I, I'm sorry. Hey, I got my books here. I want to uh, make sure I got everything, you know? But, uh, yeah, they, uh, we even fought over a couple of songs. I mean, a little bit of a kind of fight. Shambhala, we, you know, the Grassroots wanted to do that. It was by B.W. Stevens, and, and Corey and I found it about the same time, Corey Wells. Yeah. And, uh, and in fact, uh, during our show, there's, like, Three big hits that we that we turned down because of the time of people writing the songs for us and stuff like that. And we're going to throw those into the mix and play uh, three songs that we turned down. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah I'm gonna, I'll surprise you though. Okay, good. good. So now we're really stupid because they were all number one songs. Really? <laughs> <laughs> That's the way it goes. Yeah. So was it was one of them like Mama told me not to come or what? No, no, no. Not oh, okay. they weren't they weren't three dog night songs. Oh, they weren't three dog night no, songs. No, I'll, oh, okay. I'll I'll surprise you. Well, that's gonna be interesting. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's interesting. It's uh, so you know, it's the time you get the songs, you think, yeah, maybe it's a little too gummy, you know. What, 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 uh, the Dunhill label was there a lot of other different groups besides you and Three Dog Night that were well, there Steppen with Wolf. The, Okay, Stephen. Now, did you guys like have a little thing of songs that you guys picked from and said, okay, I well, like this one, I like this one? No, huh? Uh, you know, whoever was hottest at the moment would get the first pick. You know? Really? Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, you and you and Three Dog Night would have, been, would have been fighting right around that time too. Oh man, I tell you what, Corey and I had been fishing buddies. It could have gotten really dangerous. <laughs> okay, well, they were here last year, by the way. Yeah, that's what, man, I, that's what I heard. Okay, I did tell you that, didn't I? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Okay, I'm yeah, repeating yeah. myself. Repeat yourself, yeah, no. Okay, I'll let you. I guess I can let you go. <laughs> hey, it just excites me. I'm, you know, you guys. I've, I've been uh, fans of you guys for a long time. Oh, that's great, man. So that's great. Well, I have, too, except that I come from the 50s, so, see, uh, I didn't get a chance to meet you guys. I met all the 50s artists, but I was out of it by the time you guys uh, got going, so I never... You were I, out of it, huh? I, yeah, I never had a chance he's, to meet you personally. He's always been out of it. <laughs> Maybe this time I will be able to meet you personally. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Well, we're going to have to fix all that, and we'll meet you this uh, this Sunday. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Sounds like a winner to me. Okay. I'll be the one dressed as a clown. I guess they got me dressed as a clown in a parade, too, so, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm I know. Gonna, I, I agree. I'm going to act normal this time for once. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Who's going to be normal and who's going to be a clown? Well, he's never Peter's normal. Peter's going to be normal. That'll be a far stretch He'll for him. He'll be normal. <laughs> yeah. That'll Oscar's a, a clown. Right. That's right. Sounds like the odd couple. Man. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. what they've said. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Rob. My pleasure. Hold on the line for a second, and I'll, uh, I got a couple more things I got to say to you off, off the Oh, wow, off the air. Sure. I'm a little shy. You better be. <laughs> right, See everybody right. Sunday. Yeah, okay. Alrighty. Okay. Thanks, Rob. You bet. Hold on. Okay, I'll play a song here, and uh, I get to talk. We'll get to talk to him a little bit more, too, I think. Yeah. From the, from the grassroots, Rob Grill. Going to be there singing for you.